Okay, so we got our operating system update today, uh, and I want to show you some stuff, just something really quick, just graphing vertical lines and how that might be helpful. So first thing we have to make sure is that you went online, you went to education.ti.com, you went to the top right corner of that web page, and it says 3.2 version available that you updated your OS um, on your handheld, and if you have the computer version, you should have done that also. It's actually really, really easy. They made it really... Um, very friendly so let's take a look let's take a look so here we go so this is what I want to do first I want to go to my calculator and I want to insert graphs so I guess I'll do it from home and I don't want to do it from there add graphs all right so add graphs. First thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to put in like something like a, I don't know sine of x. So there's sine of x. So I want to show my professor. I want to show you. I want to show somebody that this goes through exactly one cycle from zero to two pi. So this is what I want to do. I want to do this. I want to go to menu. I want to go to graph entry edit, right? I want to go over to equation. To line. And I want to choose this line right here. So it's a little bit of screwing around about it, but it can definitely be done. You have to kind of get, you can have to get used to this. So there's zero. I'm going to do the same thing again, right? I'm going to go to menu. I'm going to go to Entry, Edit, I'm going to go to Equation, I'm going to go back to Line, I'm going to choose this, right? And now I'm going to choose, just type in 2. You can do this if you want to. There's lots of ways to do it. You could go here and hit 2 pi. Or you could type in the word pi, P-I, and it, that would work also. Hit Enter. So now I'm trying to demonstrate to my calculus class or to my trig class this is what's happening here or or I'm trying to show an interval over which I'm trying to get a trying to find the area of this curve right here so it's really really cool I think this is a and I'll be damned if I find any other calculator that can do this so I'm gonna go through tons of stuff that this calculator can do I hope you um, have your operating system updated if not do that and then come back and watch this again and anything that you figured out that you could do really well easier than I can do it, please tell me. I'd be glad to share it with other people. If you haven't already subscribed, please do. Uh, and your comments are always welcome. Thanks.